Hello everyone, so in today's video, I'm going to be making a uh, cowbell for the my briar cow, but you can make it for any cow you'd like. So the things you will need today are some pieces of leather or leather cording, a paper clip or wire, needle nose pliers and scissors, little bells that you can find at the craft store or sometimes the dollar store, glue, and a jump ring. So the first thing you're gonna do is open up your paper clip and I removed the coating from mine, or you could just use some wire. So the first thing I'm going to do is form the buckle with my paper clip. And to do that, you're going to fold the end at a 90 degree angle to form an L shape. Then you're gonna grab the long side of the L and bend it at another 90 degree angle to form kind of a square U shape. Then you're going to grab the long side again and bend it again to make a rectangle at the end of your wire. Then I adjusted it a little bit to make it more even. And then after that, I continued forming a second one underneath. So to do that, you can just grab the long side of your wire and bend it to form the number nine. And then you can bend that wire again to close the square rectangle shape at the bottom. Depending how big you make it, it might be a square or a rectangle. So after that, you can just cut off the extra wire and you should have a buckle like this. They're pretty easy to make once you get the hang of it and they uh, work really well. Next, cut a strip of your leather or you can use some faux suede cording or leather cording and you're going to slide it in through the bottom of the buckle and then over the middle piece um, into the other loop just like this and you're going to glue it in place so it should look like this then you're going to try it onto your cow by sliding the buckle by sliding the leather through the buckle and to do that I just brought it uh, up and under one side of the buckle like this and then down the other side so you can see kind of how I an in-depth version of how I do that just like this to form a loop around your cow's neck then you can cut off any extra just, and it should look something like this. Then I cut the end at an angle. Next, open your jump ring and slide your bell onto it and then close it up. Then you're going to take the uh, pliers and flatten one end of your jump ring to form a D ring. Then you're going to slide the jump ring onto the leather we prepared earlier that's attached to the buckle. And then you can just put that on your cow by bringing the end of the leather up and around the cow's neck so the rest of it will hang down under the buckle. And I just buckled that up like this. Then you can just adjust where the bell is and you're done. This would also be a really good way to make a dog collar if you just took off the bell. So you have a very easy to make cowbell or possibly dog collar. I hope you enjoyed this video and if you have any ideas for future videos I would uh, definitely like to hear them. So I will see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.